school and so I had a very uh, particular idea about how to do it which is you know from studying it very classical things like that so uh, when I got the job to do Romeo and Juliet they, uh, everything that I learned that we threw away like it like they didn't want to do anything not not the speech thing that we'd learned none of none of my diction none of the you know I, I am big pentameter like all of it was just thrown away so so that was the first time I've done I've since done uh, a few things uh, on stage but uh, and some other things, but that was my first. So did you find that there's a really big difference between trying to act out Shakespeare on, on screen and then trying to transition to that on stage? I, I mean, yeah, that was, and that was a big difference. You know, one of the things that uh, I thought was really interesting about what Baz Luhrmann had done was he, he, he wanted, he really did want to bring it to a more modern audience, even though he was using all of the original text. Um, and so he, he wanted to find uh, really uh, voices we were used to hearing. Uh, uh, patterns of speech that we were used to hearing. In fact, like two of the characters were like patterned after Beavis and Butthead, which was really <laughs> popular at the time. And so their speech goes back kind of like, <laughs> but then they'd say something like, <laughs> like very, you know, from, from the text of uh, Romeo and Juliet. And so that was the same with me. We, we found these things like we pulled from certain rappers and not rappers and, and just this sort of way of speaking. So it was, it was an interesting transition to do that stuff. It was, it was really interesting to go from all the stuff I had learned to then doing it, and also to really make it focused for, uh, for the camera, as opposed to, you know, talking to the, the back rows, you know. And the first few times I, I did, like the first few times I did the Queen Mad speech, the baddest lever would really, he'd, he'd walk up on the stage and go, uh, Harold, small, just <laughs> small. <laughs> it was just so big and outrageous, yeah. 